Okay. So. Morty, tell us, tell me, what was your first impression about? Well, I was just. I remember I had taken over that class, which was the, I think, uh, second year students, or third year, I'm not quite sure. It was really an introductory class in, um, in uh, basically getting familiar, familiarizing themselves with the 16 millimeter cameras and making, in the two semesters, one film for each semester about three minutes long, four minutes long, if you recall. And the black and white, no sound, or whatever sound they could get. Not sing sound, that's for sure. So it was really an introductory course. And um, um, I remember coming into the class and talking a lot about the films I had seen the night before or the week earlier because I was seeing a lot of these, these films with Jay Cox. He was the Time Magazine movie critic at the time. Um, and Jonathan Kaplan was in the class, John Davison, Alan Arkish, um, a number of, number of the kids and all you guys, and uh, Oliver. And Oliver was very quiet. I remember him being very quiet. And I knew that he, I knew that he had come from Vietnam and was just uh, out of the service. He never presented himself. Uh, he never went, oh, what's the word? Uh, he was not outgoing in any way. He was very quiet and uh, uh, gentle. I remember that. And I remember basically it was, uh, as a person, I could tell by the, by the, the aura that, that, was, that he gave out that, uh, it wasn't necessary to uh, uh, engage him in any kind of conversation other than what we were doing with the class. He was a person who uh, obviously had gone th some through something that none of us there had uh, could ever really understand unless we had gone through it ourselves. So I don't want to deal with that part of it. Uh, he didn't even engage you in that part. He didn't make a big deal of it. He was just very quiet. And I remember being very impressed by his short film, which I hope you show in this film. I hope he still has it. Which of Michael and Marie? No, no. The very first thing he did in that class, which was the Vietnam vet coming back. Last and, Vietnam. Yeah. And it was really quite beautiful. I remember that. It was really quite beautiful. I remember, I mean, stupid thing. We had to give grades. That was part of the academic problem of film school. And Haig Mnuchin was, our, you know, who hired me, was our, my, my teacher. Uh, and he hired me to help him out there. He said, you got to give grades. I know it doesn't mean anything, but you got to give grades. But I remember giving him an A because of the... Uh, the emotion of the piece and this, the tragedy, uh, the feeling of tragedy I, I, I had when I watched it. Something, I was 25 or 26, I mean, he's a little, is he a couple of years older, older than younger? He's a couple of years younger than me, I think, I'm not quite sure, but uh, something I, you know, I couldn't understand. It's not my way, not part of my life, uh, having been in the Army, having been in that kind of thing. I, I wasn't, I was not there, but... Uh, well, to me, he said that, um... 